today I want to show you something we've been working on with high level that we're really excited about. Uh, a few people have asked about. Let me just log in here and show you what it is. Of course, you know our dashboard and you can see I don't have my phone set up, so let's ignore this. They're still doing the A2P uh, authorization for that on this account. So you come over here to your saved listings and you can see that we have all these saved people. I can actually from right here where the viewed listings are, there's the listings. There's I can create a saved search. So if they have searches, I can say, hey, these guys are looking for properties, you know, single family residential in this area. And I want to make here's one single family Palm Beach, you know, 100,000 to a million. I can use that to create a saved search for this client if I know they don't have any saved searches. So here's safe searches that people have made. Here's safe properties. And I'll just show you. Let's say we want to look at something for this guy. Let's say uh, homes between 650 and 700 in Coral Gables with three beds, three baths. So I'll put, I didn't, uh, Six fifty to seven hundred three bed two bath, and I can select the property type. This is demo data, and so some of this stuff is just not going to work quite like it should. But we'll just say coral cables, and you can see that it already populated some values here. So it's going in and getting about thirty percent plus or minus of the price. So that that makes it super easy. And, and I can just modify that. So I'll just say, okay, I'm going to actually change this to be 650 to 700. And it's already loaded the three beds and two baths. It has some square footage. Maybe I want to remove that out of there. I can put zero or I, if I want to do that, I want something that has images. And uh, if I want to verify that there's some results for this, I can click uh, view results in a new window. And it's going to open this up and show me you know, here's here's some of the properties. This is kind of like what these guys would be seeing. So I can say, well, maybe that's too restrictive or, you know, there's only four listings. I want to get it so there's 20 or 30, so there could be updates. I can sort it a different way. I can, you know, get more properties, less properties, whatever I want to do. Anyway, create a safe search. There it is, saved for that client. I can create another safe search for them if I want to or I can go here. Now they're going to start getting updates when there's new properties that match that search criteria. That's just how easy that is. This is our new safe search. It's built right into the dashboard and we're super excited about it. Check it out.